Hi, hi, hi. My name is Erica LaShawn. Please like, share, and subscribe if you're new here. Welcome if you're not new here. Welcome. It's 4.50 p.m. It's Halloween or whatever, October 31st, 2024. So, this is like a little special or whatever. Um, I'm going to get a little heavy, but I'll bring it back up. But, um, trick-or-treating. All right, shout out to my neighbor. He's like six houses down. <laughs> the front yard is so cute or whatever. And I was just walking home. He, he invited me for shots on the stoop. And they're giving out candy. Okay, whatever. Anyway. <laughs> and his name is Jason. Whoa! Halloween. I was going to make a, a stupid joke about Jason I, I let that one go. But anyway. Anyway. <laughs> okay, Halloween. Uh, oh, the news. I said previously. Oh, they, uh... <laughs> they do... The parade is tonight in the village. But they are practicing now. It's a group. They they about... They gonna do... They gonna do the thriller. and They gonna do thriller. I ain't going nowhere. I'm about to watch the parade on TV. They go, they on, they practicing on the news. They about to do it or whatever. So anyway, um, the heavy part, um, so trick or treating was um a big thing growing up. You know, we was kids or whatever. So when I was in the tenth grade, or maybe the eleventh grade, not really sure. There was a student that um, murdered his stepbrother. And it was all over everywhere. And um, it was all over everywhere. And uh, one of my teachers, Mr. Goldberg, I think. I don't know. My sociologist. Sociology. I don't know. He was. He was. He was like. You you know when you have cool teachers, I've had a I've I've had a a few teachers that were like really cool, you know, and they made you want to learn, you know, Mr. Goldberg, Goldstein, something like that. I don't know. Goldberg, Go he arranged his class where we didn't the 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 desks weren't uh positioned like you would normally think they. Our, uh, our his class, our the 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 desks were in a circle, and he sat at the top of the circle, and uh, he we would just talk. We didn't even really do like work that you think that you would do. Or maybe we did. I'm not sure. But his impact was very good. Thank you, sir. And he just was sit at the top of the circle, and all of our all of our desks were in a circle, uh, so we can see each other, we can talk to each other, and stuff like that. All right. So let me go because I I just had a memory. I made the cheerleading squad, <clears throat> and when uh. The uh, uh, the captain Roxanne, Roxanne, Roxanne. Uh, uh, I, I always wonder how she felt about that. <laughs> if I if I read it to Roxanne right now, I'd be like, "Girl, how did you feel about that?" But anyway, Roxanne and the 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 the, the captain Roxanne and the co captain Child. I don't even know who you were, but anyway, uh. <laughs> They knocked on the door, and uh, y'all, they had red, long stem red roses, and they told my teacher, is is Erica Pitts in here? And he was like, yeah, you she right there. And I made the team or whatever. They gave me a rose or whatever, uh, and I cried in front of everybody. Okay, moving forward. <laughs> and I came home. I was like, Mommy, I made the team. 
<laughs> all right, all right. Anyway, Halloween. Let's stay on Halloween. But that's what that was. Anyway, okay. Ah, uh, oh, okay. Why? So this this teacher. Okay, let me stay on her. He was so cool, and he he crossed his legs. I don't mind when men cross their legs. Like you know how men will cross their legs or whatever like you would you would say like in a feminine way i don't mind that at all um i think the most confident men are able to like just cross their I, really i think this is what i think y'all tell me if i'm wrong but i just think it just helped their penis they don't want to smash their penis or whatever i don't know I don't have a penis, so I don't know. But when I see men cross their legs like that, I don't I don't think like that. I just, you know, they, they want to be comfortable. And, and they're confident. They're like, and? And they're like, I like it like that. Oh, no. If I see that, you got to you gotta do it. You got to be, you got to be real manly to cross your legs. I need you to cross your legs and be like, "What? What? I I don't I I I don't want you to cross them and cry. You know, you can't do that." Shout out to Tyrese. Tyrese crossed them legs. Child, you 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 <laughs> you still number one. <laughs> you still number one, huh? He sit up there on Shay Shay. Hate that name. You sit up there on Shay Shay and cross them legs in them pajamas and them slippers, shot. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> you was all right with me. You was all right with me. You wrong. You was all right with me. So it depends. All right. All right. Let me stay focused. <laughs> okay. Halloween. Um, <clears throat> so this Goldberg, Goldstein, Mr. Mr. Whatever his name was, what he, he made his class, the, the desks were in a circle. So part of, we had a, a field trip. I'm from a small community. I'm from Oak Park, Michigan. So right off eight mile, you know, I'm, I'm nine mile in Coolidge or whatever, but it was all right there or whatever, but you know, so our, <laughs> our court, the police station, I mean, everything was like really close because we're like a, ta a, a, a town. <laughs> so I took tennis. Tennis was one of my classes. The tennis court was across the street. Um, it was May. Oak Park Boulevard. <laughs> Whoa. So we crossed Oak. We crossed the street because the tennis course was on the other side of the street. So that's how I took tennis. So I took tennis. It wasn't in a class. We met or whatever. I guess I don't know. It's all a blur. So, <laughs> oh god. So I'm about to do a little side piece or whatever. So, taking tennis, we're doing doubles, right? <laughs> right? So, my partner, I had some boy I was partner with, and there was some other kids that was on the other side. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. I forgot this boy name. That ball was coming, y'all. <clears throat> that ball was coming, y'all. Whoever that boy, whoever you are, honey, whoever you are, sweetheart. Oh, he was going to get that ball. He was going to get that ball, y'all. Y'all, he turned around and straight up clocked me in my forehead trying to get that ball. He was like, boom. If you know tennis, the net is in the middle, but the wood. And I think I spoke about this in a previous video. Maybe, maybe not. Whatever. You got that wood, that wood rim. The the rim is wood, but the middle is, the middle is a net. This boy, whoever you are, sweetheart, thank you. This boy was trying to get that ball so bad. He, 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 he. <laughs> I want to curse. I'm trying to be nice. It's Halloween. He clocked the shit out of me in my forehead. He was like, boom. I was like, oh. 
Oh my God, is that the doorbell? Did I order anything? I think it's Amazon. I can't. No. I ain't ordered nothing. Okay, okay, I'll go. He clocked me in my forehead trying to trying to get that trying to hit that ball y'all I, I went through the whole day it was like a golf ball is that a contusion oh my god i can't do it i can't i can't i can't okay okay no for real y'all this is incredible this is incredible i'm doing this because I, I i got locked out the other day in my hold on hold on yes uh, I have a package delivery for apartment two, but they don't seem to be open. Okay, coming. Ridiculous. <clears throat> Y'all, and I'm not going to stop. Because <clears throat> we, we look out for each other. So I'm about to take y'all on a ride. We look out for each other. I'm about to take y'all on a ride. Where's my robe? <clears throat> That girl, the, the, the new girl downstairs opened the door for me because uh, my keys. I left my keys upstairs. That girl, her hair was wet and everything. She opened the door. Damn it, I ain't mean for this to happen. So we gonna do it. Because I gotta... I don't care. I don't care. I know you don't. Is this rope on right? Give me a sec. I don't care. Whatever. I'm one take, Jake. I don't want to stop it. <clears throat> Give me one second. <clears throat> okay, so anyway. So he clocked me upside the head. <laughs> so I had, a, I had to go through... I had a knot on my head through the whole day. Because that boy, he, he was so sad looking. He was looking at me like, I'm sorry. I'm like, oh, I'm all right. And by the end of, um, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hi. Just leave it there. I know. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> we look out for each other. <clears throat> anyway. <clears throat> so <laughs> he clocked me in the head. Where am I going with this? Okay, so um back to the teacher. <clears throat> he took us on a field trip across the street to the courthouse. And uh a student killed his um stepbrother so we went to the we went to the hearing that was our field trip so we went to the hearing it was like a much a bunch of kids at the hearing and I was quoted in the paper um a news reporter I don't know it's all a blur. All right. Um, <clears throat> the news was out there or whatever, and um, what somebody stopped me and asked me, so I'm I'm quoted and I got the clip. It's in my it's at my mother's home, <clears throat> and some plastic or something, but. <clears throat> I was um like quoted in like a a local news uh thing, but the only thing I will say <clears throat> he he went to class with us like he was a kid like us, and he it was a search for his stepbrother. And you know, as the story goes on or whatever, they found him in a a a, a a a space wrapped in a carpet, rolled up in a carpet or whatever. But I want to say his name, but I don't. Um, 
So my teacher took us to the hearing. And all I got all I um, all I'm gonna say, let me say focus. His name is Jamar. Uh We locked eyes. I swear to God, I locked eyes with a murderer. And uh all his peers, we 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 are we we all I, I was I was staring at him. Cause I couldn't believe it. Cause they was looking for the little boy for for a couple weeks, and they found out he was downstairs, wrapped up, uh, in the in the crawl space, or whatever. So I was just staring at him, and uh, we locked eyes. And um, I looked into the eyes of a murderer. Um. So moving forward with Halloween, this could have been the next year or the year after that. I don't know. We were still trick-or-treating at this point. We were still dressing up because we wanted the candy. And it's just a way to get out and have some fun or whatever. So we stumbled upon the street of the murder. The family was gone or whatever. You know, it was like, you know, it was years later, a couple, you know, it was whatever. But we all knew, like, that's that's the house. And we was trick-or-treating all up and down the street. But when we got to that house, we was like, that's the house. No, that's the house. And it, it had the light on. So if you don't know, like, for... I'm from the Midwest. I'm from Michigan or whatever. If you cut your light on, other people do this or whatever. If the light is on, that means, okay, you know, come, you know. But the light didn't look right to me. I, it was like a, it was like a single light. I, I don't know. Uh, and as a group, because we did it in groups, we would trick-or-treat in groups. No, we, we was like, y'all, that's the house. That's the house. And somebody was like, well, let's go. Somebody was like, I ain't going. Uh, that could have been me. Um, <clears throat> we didn't want to go. It looked spooky. The light didn't even look right. And that's the house that we all know about. And it, it just didn't look right. And uh, we skipped that house. And we went to the next house. Spooky. We knew. <clears throat> okay, moving forward. Oh, okay. I'm looking at my notes. I be taking notes or whatever. Okay. So there was this one this one nice little white lady. She was so sweet. She didn't give out candy. Y'all. Y'all. She gave out five pennies. I'm not playing. And she had them wrapped up. So she had five pennies in these little plastic bags. Do y'all know the, the level of disappointment for a child? You know, she was so nice or whatever. We all was looking like, what? <laughs> so sweet. Five pennies. All wrapped up individually. We we was looking like, well, I can't speak for them. Me, I'm looking like, child, please. I got home. I probably told on her. I probably was like, mommy, daddy, look, 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 look at this, you know. Thank you, lady. Thank you. Anyway, the pities. Oh. Uh, Okay, Halloween. I'll try to stay focused. All right, Halloween. It's, uh, it's Halloween or whatever. I'm staying in. Oh, Devil's Night. I'm from Michigan, so I don't know about other states or whatever, but the night before Halloween, we call it Devil's Night. And that's where it's, uh, crime goes on. You know, stuff going on it's on Devil's Night. So you kind of stay in the night before because... 
I don't know, you know. But then you might go out on Halloween and you might get your candy, you might get your bag snatched, though. <laughs> you might. If you got some riffraffs, you might have a riffraff or two. They were snatching bags, but I, I never experienced that. But <clears throat> so we was worried about that. People were snatching candy. <laughs> anyway, one year, I, I'm just reliving Halloween. So just bear with me. My nephew James, he like 30 so He was born in 1990. He, 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 you know, he, whatever. So when he was little, I was like, oh, I'm going to get a pumpkin. And me and James, we going to carve this pumpkin. So I went and got a pumpkin. <laughs> Carving a pumpkin is not fun. I got the knife to go with it. Because there's, a, there's, a, there's a, a special knife that you use to carve a pumpkin. The eyes, the mouth, all that stuff. Once I went through that, I would never do that again. But that's life. That's life. <laughs> you live you live, and you learn. I didn't know I had to... <clears throat> I didn't know I had to gut the pumpkin. So I cut the top off. And it's all the seeds and the veins and the gush and all that. So I'm like, oh my God. And James sitting there looking like... You know, he's just looking at me like... You know, I, we, we, you know, we hung tight, you know? <laughs> so my nephew, he had to be like five. I don't know. He was looking at me like, go ahead, you know? I I put the newspaper down on the table. I had to gut, I had to gut the pumpkin. See, when you see these jack-o'-lanterns and these pumpkins and stuff like that, people put in work for that. I, I really appreciate when people have pumpkin jack-o'-lanterns and pumpkins and stuff like that that ain't that ain't <laughs> that ain't nothing that, that no that's it is something excuse me it's something so i had to cut the top off and i looked in the pumpkin it was all these seeds and gush and veins and i had to dig the whole thing out james was sitting there like he ain't helped me at all <laughs> well he's a kid so <clears throat> and it was my idea, so whatever. Y'all, I had to, ugh, it's disgusting. I had to gut the pumpkin out. And then the eyes, the mouth, the whole thing. So really appreciate when you see a jack-o'-lantern, <clears throat> especially the ones that's lit up on the inside. I'm like, oh, oh, yeah, because I did it and it sucks. It sucks getting the mouth the, the jaggedy teeth, the jaggedy mouth, all that. You got to cut all that, go up and down. It sucks, okay? All right. <laughs> I did it, so what? <clears throat> anyway, so uh, back to, I'm, I'm trying to stay on Halloween. Okay, so um, I've been in the audience. Uh, I'm a fan of Wendy Williams. I really am. I hope she's doing well. Hi. Right. So I've been in the audience like four times or whatever. It's so it it got so bad one time. One time my brother said one Halloween my brother was out. I caught him. I was like, Eric, you know, we just we just rap. We just finished. He, my brother, cause she was live. My brother said, I knew you was gonna be there. <laughs> I said, Did you see me? He said, Yeah, I knew you was gonna be there. So two out of the four times was on Halloween. So one time I was a 19, 1920s flapper girl, okay? And one time I was Dorothy from the Wizard of Oz or whatever. So I had to run to Party City because I, be, I can't be Dorothy without Toto or whatever. So I ran to Party City. They had Toto in his basket or whatever. So, so here's the funny part. <laughs> oh, my God. Ah. <sighs> Um, the show is awesome. Another time we caught Tony Braxton, I was floored. I even, you know, they don't tell you nothing. They don't tell you nothing. You just be there. 
Y'all, when they said t Tony Braxton, y'all came out there, I was like, oh, God. I love her. And your sister, Tamar. I like her too. People don't, I don't know, whatever. So, and they give you a big bag of candy when you leave. Like when you walking out, everybody get this huge bag of candy. So it's cool. But the funny part is when I was Dorothy, when I came as Dorothy or whatever, <clears throat> the costume come like a costume. So you got to get your own accessories or whatever. So, you know, I have my um, red pumps. They were suede, cute, suede, whatever. And I, I had to get a, a we, some call it a candy cane. And others call it a, I don't know what other people call it, but a candy cane. It's a thing that you put under the garment to poof it out. It's like white. And it's, it's, it's an undergarment <clears throat> that poofs out the dress. So I had that on with, with a candy cane underneath. And I, look, okay, I had on some red panties, right? And the bottom was ruffles. You know, I'm trying to be cute in my mind. Uh, oh, good God. So when the show was over, everybody getting ready to go. You know, I'm packing up. I'm getting ready to go. I'm standing in front of the whole audience getting ready to go. I'm trying to put my Uggs on. I love Uggs. I'm trying to put my boots on. Y'all, I forgot where I was. Uh, do y'all know I moon the audience? I was putting my foot in. I put my foot in the first boot. And then I put my foot in the other boot. And my mind said, girl. And I was like, oh my God. Uh, Y'all, it was for real. It was for real. It was so real. Like picture putting on some boots and you been you you you're bent over trying to put put them on. Yeah, it was for real for real. It was so for real that I just squatted down and laughed. The crew saw it. I I was everybody saw it. I know that crew saw it. They was like I straight up did a full bend bend over situation to put my boots on and it was like for real straight up for real i look good from every angle oh <laughs> I, I just stooped down i just i just laughed i just was laughing like oh my god anyway anyway so so uh, j just to stay on wendy i hope all is well I went um, right after Hurricane Sandy. I don't know what year. Um, the hurricane hit. And we had tickets the next day. And we still went. And Wendy came out and um, thanked us for coming. Because it was a whole tragedy yesterday. And we still went. And she cried. Y'all y'all didn't see Wendy cry before. So she came out and was like, I didn't even think y'all was going to come. <clears throat> this was before taping. She said, I, I didn't think anybody was going to come. And we were there. And then she started crying. Then we started clapping. Okay. There's a... You, oh, gosh. Hmm. All right. All right, I'm I'm gonna stay on Halloween because I was about to get on something else. Eh. All right, I would I witnessed the closing, a closing. Wendy did a movie, and I'm not even sure if it's gonna be. I was an extra in it, so you may not ever see it. Uh. And then <clears throat> one time she did a ending to the her movie, but it, as y'all know, it, there's no movie. And she said it was right when the show started from the radio, and she and she 
we we all taped it together. We was all together. You didn't see the people, but we was all there. And she said, My, I, I, it's not over yet. It's not over yet. You know, I'm still going, you know, whatever. But we we did the ending with her. And she was like, I'm in my chair. I'm here. Whatever. Um, we may not ever see that, but... um. Um, <laughs> shout out to my friend LaJoya. I love you. The only child that had it all. Thank you so much. Miss <laughs> Jackson had a Halloween party for LaJoya, and all the kids came. Y'all, this was the first time I saw dry ice. Miss Jackson had dry ice. We talking, you know, dry ice. It comes out like a, it's a cloudy, cloudy thing. Miss Jackson had the dry ice. We was bobbing for apples. Everybody was in the costume. However, my, I love my mother. I'm going to call her in a sec. I'm like, mommy, I need a costume or whatever. My mother, because people love her, so she probably was able to finagle. She came home with a brown, a big brown bag I opened it up y'all it was a gorilla costume wait till I call her I'm about to call her right after I get off <laughs> full suit with a with a with a uh uh a, 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 a head piece I said mommy she said well you know I think she loaned it I think she loaned it from somebody at her job people loved her you know Y'all was a gorilla at LaJoya's party. Like, if you see a mascot for a team or, or an event or something like that, it was like a suit with the head that go with it. I was a straight gorilla banging, and then nobody touched me at that party. I was a gorilla. <laughs> we talked... Just let your mind, just let your mind go. Just think a gorilla. Just, he was brown. Just think a gorilla, body, suit, and head. That's where we going. I went to that party. I was a gorilla at that party. Oh, yes. And, and the suit disappeared because you know what? My mother had to give it back. <laughs> Whoever she got it from, whoever she borrowed it from, whatever, that suit is gone. I was a straight gorilla. Y'all, I could have been a, a boy under there. Y'all don't, y'all don't know, but I was a girl under there. I was a straight gorilla, y'all. We bob for apples and everything. All right. Okay. I'm done. Hold on. Yeah, I'm done. I was gonna talk. I was gonna talk about something else, but I don't feel like it. I'm over it. My name is Erica Lashawn. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thanks, bye.